nose change. Today I want to give you a quick tip to help you enhance your craft beer tasting experience. If you're like me, living in Central Florida, or lack a reverse osmosis water filtration system to your house, you're probably going to end up with some hard water stains and mineral deposits on your glasses. So, um, without getting in PhD level chemistry, um, for some of you home brewers and beer geeks out there, you know how pH uh, relates to the brewing process and beer overall. To put that in perspective, uh, beer has a pH of about 3.7 to 4.1 on average, which means it's acidic. What does that mean to you? Well, other things that are really acidic, like toilet bowl cleaner. Acids are really good at removing, beer, removing mineral deposits from your toilet bowl. Not that I'm suggesting you should clean your toilet bowl with beer, but if you have any mineral deposits or hard water stains, as some people call it, on your beer glass, believe me, your beer is going to wash that off and you're going to end up tasting it. So here's a quick way to season a glass before you have your beer. What I like to do is just pour a couple ounces of beer in there, swirl it around. Better do this over the sink, but for purposes of this video, I'll use a glass. Just swirl it around to get it close to the, to the, to the rim of glass as possible. Swirl it around. Stick your finger in there, hopefully your finger's clean, and just swirl it around the, extra, the outside of the glass or anywhere your mouth or your lips are going to be tasting. Now, just pour that beer as a sacrifice to the Egyptian beer goddess ten in it, and pour the rest of the beer in. Now, you can try this at home with this technique or just by using a beer glass that you already drank full beer out of. Um, then take a couple ounces of beer and pour it in an unseasoned glass and taste both of them see if you can taste the difference. Thanks for tuning in. I hope this is a great tip. More to come soon. Thanks. Did you drink the last beer? You bastard! This has been a Beer Bastard production. For more information, check the link below. Welcome to Beer Bump.